right, well, we are back outside, and we are with the Glen Tartan truck. Kathleen McConville from the Glen is uh, back here, and so is Jason. Now, earlier in the segment, we cooked up some fish and all the different kinds you have. Yes. Now we're switching gears and making uh, fish tacos. Yeah. Like a happy choice, I let Jason describe it, it's his creation. Yeah. yeah. There are just a couple of different menu options that we okay. do. A bit of a healthier option. It was more for the summer menu. Okay. Um, basically, all we've done is uh, taken some mahi mahi, lightly baked it. Um, we use some nice romaine lettuce instead of a taco. Okay. That way it's uh, much healthier. Right. Raw salad. Splash of mango salsa and avocado. Oh wow! I'm just yeah. gonna dig into a yeah. little bite here because I don't think I can, you know, eat that whole thing pretty gracefully on television. And what kind of salsa is on here? That is a spicy aioli. It's got a little bit of a kick to it, but it's more of a smoky flavor. Delicious! Wow! And this is your creation? I had just one of the new menu items, newer menu items. And so, you can make that yeah. right here in this truck on location. Yep, we can do anything out of this truck. It's fully loaded, as you can see. Yeah, it's and it's big. It's very beautiful spacious beautiful. as well. Yeah. Kathleen, why did you guys decide to go on the road? Uh, just because one of the most asked questions is, oh, why can't you put a plane in the East End, or why can't you right, put a plane here? Right, right. So uh, that is in the works, but right now it's just getting out there, and uh, the market is there. everywhere. And with this truck, we've got a couple of weddings coming up, the Midnight Buffet. We have a four-foot walk-in cooler, so we can go hundreds of people. Okay. Uh, there's no limits. So we there's no limits in terms of numbers. And pretty much no limits in terms of what you can make in no. here either, eh, Jason? What is this little concoction? Well, that's a, a traditional squash meat pie. Okay. Um, and, and then what we've got is just served it with some uh, our, our house beans. Um, just as something different than this. Oh, it's a bit of a healthier option again. Than, Another uh, healthier option. Fries. And so, sorry, what's in a Scottish pie? Scottish meat pie is mutton, Ooh. which is sheep. Okay. Um, I don't think I've ever had this before in my life. It's savory, it's nice. And it's... I've been to Scotland. How funny is that? Okay. Is it kind of like lamb? Yes. Yeah. Very much. Oh, that's quite, I like that. That's really good. And then last but not least. Yes. Yeah. This one looks very interesting <laughs> and very tasty. Yeah, that's a little bit cheeky, but it's a deep fried marsh bar, so if you have to uh, indulge now and again, that, that's the way to go. Hey, who doesn't indulge before 9 o'clock in the morning, right? <laughs> So you make this right here in location too? Is it just basically a Mars bar deep fried? Is that exactly what it is? Yeah. Yeah. Oh wow. And this people can order as well when they reserve yeah. you? We uh, sold out at the last, last two events. We had, uh, we had sold out deep fried Mars bar. We actually ran out of uh, everything, which is great. Because the last thing you want is to do is better to say sorry. See you next year. That's we'll amazing. Yeah, we're really pleased. Did you guys have a few events coming up as well? Yeah, October 1st and uh, Richmond Fair. And a couple of weddings, so yeah, and a couple of corporate events. We're actually looking for a, a space to put it uh, from Monday to Friday. Okay. So if anyone out there wants to get a, a hold of us, uh, it, it's a beautiful shop. It's not, it's, I mean, people know right. it's going down the highway and all, but it's, like, it's quite funny. Oh, I bet. But, yeah, so it was made in Alexandria, Kitchen on Wheels, and uh, so shout out to them. And, and a shout out to all your fabulous viewers. Come to the Glen and come see us. It's been two months you've been on the road. How has business been? You said you've been really busy. Uh, the first We've only done like four events, and okay. the first two I would have to say were painful because we just didn't, we didn't have a cold. Oh, right. But uh, uh, last week we were at uh, Amor Highland Games and we just, we Things were on, we were on now. You know yeah, how it yeah. works. We know. And if people want to reserve you or find you, how can they do so? If you go to www.glen.ca, uh, you can contact us at the restaurant at 836-5622 in Spitsco, and we'd be glad to sit down and, and make your event special. Perfect. I love it. And I highly suggest it because this food is absolutely amazing. It is. It's, I mean, Scottish food and British food gets a bad rap, but, you know, we're bringing it to a new level and oh, it's so the menu great. is extensive. I love it. All, All right. right. Well, thank, thank you so much, much for joining you. us here this morning.